Hello, so we are back. I did a little bit of running, so this is the place you come through the window. And looks like the lights are all on, which is a mistake, I don't know. It shouldn't be on, because I, I snuffed all of them, so be careful when you load your game. The light... The lights will be on again. But why? I killed everyone and I... Sh Okay, I guess it doesn't really matter. Any secrets behind the paintings? No. <sighs> this nice little fireplace. Now, if you remember correctly, last time I didn't really explore this place, so let's see. I guess this is street level. Yeah, the atmosphere makes it 100% better for me. Someone needs sleeping, uh, sleeping over there. Why is this guy alive and why is he down there? I thought I killed everyone. Oh, well, I guess we'll have to kill him again. Maybe just be sleeping because he's lazy. We definitely weren't here. Yeah, this is probably just a dead end because you shouldn't be able to cross into the other courtyard. A health potion. Oh, wow. Unbelievable. Yeah, we have also health potions. I don't want to step into the fire because that would probably burn me. Looks like we have some people on the lower level, so this is floor number one, and that's the... Well, I guess it depends on which country you are from. This should be floor number zero, or the... I don't know what's called in English, the basement. So, okay, let's do this very, very... thematical. A great exercise for your lungs. Blowing out candles like that. Yeah, we have been here. Exactly, I remember where I left the body, so yeah, the game is pretty complex. Sadly, as you can see, this map doesn't help you at all. This is what, one thing I don't like about the game. Because if they give you a lot of buildings with multiple floors, the map is useless and you have to remember everything by heart. It's not ideal. Look at this, you are here, what is here? I don't know, it doesn't even show the... Multiple levels. It's okay, so that's the office room, but we cannot enter it, we have to go above it. This mini game is so annoying. <laughs> yeah, whatever, I hate it. Okay, 
Okay, so explored every bit of every little location. So we can go over there to the other floor. What about this one? Okay, we'll also explore that one. Nowhere we can go from there. Okay, this is a dead end. Now we're getting places. It took me only five minutes to remember what I was doing. Okay, so everywhere there is a dead end. We open this door by why? Well, you know me, I have to double check everything, so this is a little bit boring. But I guess it's also pretty important to see the my ideas or how I approach these problems because you'll get lost very easy. And yeah, I don't know if there, are, there is a reason to keep everyone alive. Just make things a lot harder for yourself. Okay, so that's a dead end. Which means... Yeah, I guess you need kind of like a breadcrumb trail to remember all of this, and this is the office. Okay, so we have reached the office area, but there's a guard over there. We'll handle him later. Hmm. Eating, my favorite activity. So... What type of arrows do we have over here? I guess it's just regular arrows. Normal arrowhead shaft. I forget you can do this. Hey, it's so fun. So all the... Hey, come on. Oh, we can play a lot of little games with this, so... That's bronze. It's a little weird, sometimes it doesn't work as intended, so... Oh yeah, we have to actually acquire this inventory space, I forgot about that. It seems like it's big, but it's not that big. Yellow necklace, blue necklace, white necklace. Okay, sadly... Hmm. I think I'll be able to open that pick lock, it's so annoying. It's still very confusing where I am because I don't know, they could have done a little better work with the level design so you don't get lost so often. Where am I? It looks so similar, I mean it's wood and floors. Okay, so in the middle there are the two boxes that we can use that will get us straight over here, so that's the dead end thing, this is the... okay, okay. 
So let's see where this leads us. I keep. Why is it so annoying? Hey, calm down. I mean, I want all of the resources for sure. Yeah, I cannot jump that. Oh, this is over here, okay. Now I know where to go, but I don't want to go there. Just yet. I just want to see what's over here in this floor. Well, there's probably is a lot of death. Peekaboo, I see you. You don't see anyone. I don't think we can... We can eliminate all of the light sources from here. What is this one? Oh, you gotta be joking, so the entrance to this place was this... Well, I guess this only proves one thing, there are a lot of pathways you can access and go to the place you need. Now we're 100% sure where to go. We've explored every place, so we have probably gotten... Man, I hate this. You have to wait a little bit before you can jump again. So jump once, wait a little bit, and then jump again. I think I want to shoot... This guy with my bow, but I don't think I'll be able to do it. So let's watch his movement pattern a little bit. Oh, I already lost him. I don't suppose you can do a drop kill. What's it called? Drop kill? I don't remember. them in a nice corner of the room where nobody will see him. Three, four, five. Rooftop, rooftop office staircase. Actually, accumulating quite a bit of wealth. Okay, that's not going to open. Now what? I don't remember where to go. <laughs> it's been a while. I have the 
Hard room key in the captain. Oh no, I have to go to the rooftop office, but I don't remember. Yeah, this game could be a little less maze like, especially these first parts. I still hear voices, but the voices are coming from a different location. I don't think that is. I mean, 100% there is no one left alive. I have to go back. I have to go over here and over here. We'll exit. Because this shortcut is here for a reason. So we can only craft... Is that a bleeding arrow? Okay, so from now I have to... I think think about so in the beginning I think we went through some staircases I don't remember if there were behind us or hmm. Hmm. yeah I don't like mazes like this especially because uh, located in the rooftop office so where is the rooftop office then do I have to go here? So this was a room I crossed to get. Yeah, it's too maze like. I don't like it. So this is the cart room. I can only pick in it. Wait, what key did we pick up actually? Rooftop office staircase. This is going to annoy me very much. I don't think I can jump over these things. Yeah, I simply forgot how to get to the rooftop office because it's been such a long time. <laughs> That looks like fun, but also like it's dangerous. Oh no. I guess in the meantime we could save again. <laughs> yeah, I don't like I prefer it when the games are relatively straightforward. when it comes to my objectives I guess we can save over here and then try to go back a little bit 
to that way is not accessible. To here there is nothing except a very long hallway. come back to this place again so what is it what is the rooftop office i i think the map should give you a lot more hints like hey what i cannot jump to the pigs that's for sure No, some games have that invisible line that you press a button and it shows you where you have to go. I kind of miss that mechanic right now. Because I have the key, I have the objective, I know what to do, where to go, but I don't find the right way. Man, it's so... It's not a card room. Do I have to use a pick lock to open that room and that will take me there? I don't think they would hide the room behind the pick lock. And I wish they were, all the rooms were available to him. I mean, it let me open every room so I know what's behind it. So let me think about this again. Wow, it's been 15 minutes of me wandering around. This doesn't lead anywhere, right? Right, because it's a dead end on both spots. Where was it? I wish you could put map markers or something. This is ridiculous. So that way is the right way. There is only one way, no matter where I go. I guess at some point I'll just find it if I just wander around. Maybe it's in the first building and I'm not remembering clearly. Okay, let's try. Uh, lucky for us we don't have hunger or any other mechanic. That requires us to spend resources at the same, at a set date. Cover, cover from what and from where? Huh, that would have been interesting if you could go over there. Okay, let's go back into the big building. Maybe you'll figure things out. But I distinctly remember a place where I could... Mm, okay, maybe it's inside. Come on, climb up again. Oh no, is it really that stupid? Yeah, it's really that stupid. It was over here all along and I didn't figure it out. Well, I blame the game, of course. Wow, it was all the way over here and I didn't... My brain didn't even register that it could be over here.
Because why would it be here? Doesn't make sense. And then you open this door, which means you can go upstairs. What is that on the floor? Which is great, but eh, it's too maze like. This doesn't actually do anything for you, it just confuses you even more. I'm not going to remake the video just for this. I blame it on the game. <laughs> Top office. Beautiful game design. Do I see something? No, you don't. Bloody swine! You got to be joking me, I don't even see where the entrance is because of the stupid camera angles. You're a dead man. Weep. You know what? Just kill me. Okay, just kill me and I will accept the reload. Do I see something? You can even fall down the stairs. It was so easy to get over there and I didn't understand. Oh, you. We... I will not leave him alive because of this, but first... It's bloody freezing. This looks like a nice corner to drop the, the living person and then turn it into a dead body. Oh. I'm also curious, what are the items you can pick up if you get the extra perk to get more items? Elf potion. Okay, a little more. The cart room key, captain's office rooftop. I'm in the rooftop office and I don't see the key. I might have made the tactical error. Uh, let's see if we can get out of this uh, situation. And the game lets you jump on it. Yes, that was mildly annoying. <sighs> Little nippy tonight. Yeah, sorry about that. I didn't want to make a huge blood stain on the floor, but the game is annoying. Uh, okay, I can play for a few more minutes until I figure where the key is. Another problem is that you're not really sure when you're supposed to stealth or not.
Well, let's just see he was the wrong, in the wrong place at the wrong time. If the key is not here, then it has to be somewhere around here. I'll just pile the bodies, I don't care anymore. Puzzle. Let me pretend I'm smart. So it's five forty five, right? No, it is five forty five. The quest to the card room. Take the passage to the gate. This one is easy to understand. I don't know why it, did, why it doesn't work for the medium one. I like that all of the, oh that's a lock the lock on the floor. All of these places have so many things, but they're just for decoration. makes a little more sense. Yeah, let's see what else is on the rooftop except death. I think the guard you killed inside was the guard that was patrolling this area. Or maybe not. That's bad. I really want to use an arrow. So an arrow counts as a hit. And that's about it. That's not too good, nice, because that means it, I need 5 arrows to kill one of these guys. Bleeding? Probably. No, no, don't pick up the body. So you don't even get the arrows back, so what's the point then? We'll make our, we'll drink some orange juice and we'll get more blood back. <laughs> eh, it's the fastest way to do it like this. So, what are we defending over here?
I go down, I'll be able to use a rope arrow, but then I cannot come back. Oh, weird. So what's the point of this huge rooftop area then? Yeah, you just uh, get spot, you go, go around and reach in, you come back in the same place that you left. Yeah, he's fine over there. Nothing over here that I can use. Nothing there I can use. So it's totally pointless to come up the roof unless you want other ways to come up and down. Now, is it faster if I go this way? I guess it's faster if we go this way. Let's try it. I assume we end up very very close to the Yeah to the cart room mm, No, this is not the safe area Safe area Good thing the enemies don't respawn. That would have been another annoying thing. Mm, I have to go even back. Sorry about this, I think the videos are too long, but man, this is very confusing, especially at this stage. So this is the safe shrine, so it is the cart room. Let me guess, it's not in here. Not in here, why oh okay, this is the cart room. The train heading to Arangel City. Okay, and this is exactly the part after the gate. Sadly, this is one of the problems of the game. You have to face the guard. You have to face him forward in order for you By the lady. to grab him. But that means you cannot... Over here! See what I mean? You... You basically wander around like him like a stupid because you don't have the prompt 
to attack him. Yeah, you don't have the prompt to attack him while he's... No, this is stupid. Do you need to fix this? You should be able to strangle or a quick time kill someone. As long as you are near them. It shouldn't matter if you are facing away or with on them. It's a dumb decision. Also, you have to. I see you, bloody swine. Let's come out. I'll send you to the gallows. No ah. mercy for you. <laughs> okay, all of these mechanics together are annoying. You know what? Let's do it tonight. I don't want to do it tomorrow. So I have to hide. It doesn't. I cannot kill all of them. So, yeah, it's, I don't know, it's different. They, they should fix this system. Because there's no way around it, uh, you will get stuck, I mean, if the guard moves and you're trying to grab him, you have to walk closer and closer to him before you can grab him, and that means he has a much higher chance of catching you. See no evil, hear no evil. You're a dead man. I guess at some point you can just run away. Because you. it doesn't matter that much. What's that? Wow. There are so many of them. Hmm, probably have to do something over there as well. Yeah, I cannot do this today. There is a lot of work on this area. There are too many dead ends in my opinion. What? I'm hiding. <laughs> You're a dead man. Okay, see you next time. Bye.